Hi everyone, it's Sonia here and today we'll be making this beautiful mermaid theme altered MDF artwork. So for this I have taken around 10 and a half inch by 8 inch MDF letter. I got this from Crafts Lane and I am using my gesso for my base coat. Using gesso uh, make sure that whatever the medium you use on the top of your uh, uh, base it doesn't harm it and it really protects it for a longer durability so after applying gesso I make sure that I make it dry completely once my gesso has dried now I'm using my modeling paste to give it a nice texture as I'm using um, making this in mermaid theme I didn't had any wavy or uh, stencil so I'm using this one hope this turns out to be good I have left some of the portion in the center while using my modeling paste because I knew I'm going to use lots of uh, embellishments there. Once my modeling paste is dry, I am using shimmer paints from Crafty Scrappers and this is my a must have for almost all the projects. Uh, you can see my little one uh, in between. She even helped me with this project. Yeah, at the end you can see her helping me out okay so I'm using shimmer paint blue <coughs> shade here and I'm just playing around with the color with a lighter shade on some side and uh, a darker shade on some other parts of the alphabet just to give it a more of natural water and uh, greenish look After my colors have dried out completely, I am using mermaid theme uh, mudra stamp set for stamping on the base of my bottom of my uh, MDF. I am using the bushes stamp here. Once I am done with the stamping, now I am going to assemble my uh, natural embellishments which I have been collecting for years now. So I have taken up few uh, pebbles of uh, sea green color, white color, some shells, different color stones here and i'm using glue drops to stick these these are really a good way to stick your uh, your embellishments in your project because uh, they are at times a little easy to remove and uh, we can shift them here and there as per our convenience so i really like using glue drops for these uh, embellishment sticking After sticking my uh, most of the embellishments now I am going to use again the shimmer paints just to fill up the edges and I wanted to give a little darker uh, or a shadowy look to my embellishments that's why I am using uh, shimmer paints without any water just the shimmer paints beneath my embellishments.
after finishing my coloring now i'm using shimmer paste uh, that's nv shade uh, for my uh, bushes and just to finish up the edges of my mdf letter uh, this color really goes well with my theme and it really gives a nice texture to my palette and enhances the look of the theme Adding a sentiment is a must for mine project and here I had to cause it's a first birthday party decor. So I have this happy birthday sentiment stamp and I'm using this cutout for my alphabet. Finally, I have added cute little uh, shells uh, on the sides of my embellishments and finished it up with uh, sequins from Mudra stamps. I hope you like this project. Please do subscribe to my channel. Thank you.